Hello everyone, Thranks is here, and welcome back to Project High Rise Las Vegas, Episode 2, where we are setting up our mega resort. We have, um, let me see, I'm pretty sure we have Alice in the Central Park Girls. Yeah, coming today at 2100, that's pretty cool. Let's look at some more contracts we can get here. Mmm, business travelers. Eh, I don't really want to go that road yet. Double rooms. Ooh. Um, yeah, we can sign up for that. So we need to get some double standard hotel rooms and have a higher uh, an occupancy rate of 85%. Perfect. Okay, I like that. Um, hmm, where do I want these double rooms to be is the question. Let's go ahead and speed up time here. So we're making a lot of money. That's good. And let's see. So if we go to, yeah, double rooms, double occupancy hotel room. Hmm, okay. Pretty good size. Hmm. We could put five of them down over here, but I'm gonna need I'm gonna need another elevator over here eventually, I believe. Hmm. Let's uh. Let me see here. Seventy-five guests check into your hotel. And two small casinos. That's really what we need to get to work on. Is another casino. Um, and in fact, the music is a little low. I'm not sure why that is. Okay. Let's. <laughs> okay. Let's look at these casino options. Small casino needs electric, phone, cable, and HVAC. And it's pretty good size. We could start with this over here. Probably want to put this on the ground floor, right? Oh, there we go. The bar is filling up. Everybody's showing up for the... Oh, look at this. We got Buzz. Hmm. Hmm. City's economy is slowing down. Rents and costs are returning to their normal levels. Okay. Hey, look at that cash flow. Making pretty good money. Now, it doesn't look like we made as much as it says. Hmm. One-time revenues. Daily rent. Oh, okay, okay. So the revenue for the people checking into the hotel is not automatic, I see. Hmm. I kind of want the casino to be... We're going to have to... We're going to have to rethink how we're doing this over here. Okay, let's go ahead and get some utilities. That's what we're going to need. Because I want to place the casino down. Right? Well, we can't do a nightclub until we have four prestige. Well, marquees. We need the glitz and glamour consultant. No. Let's do the casino. I'm thinking right here would be pretty cool. And then maybe put the elevator on the other side. That would be neat. Let's do that. So we're going to need at least one here and there. And then the elevator is going to be, what, three? Okay. Sounds good to me. And then what we'll do is we'll go ahead and put the casino... Right up here. Uh, but we need the infra we need the utilities in place. All right, let's let's look at that. So we're gonna need cable TV, 
which um, actually we could go ahead and probably expand our water and then we could get rid of one of these and the same with electricity we could do that so then we can come over here and we could say destroy you and destroy you and we're still got plenty of extra and we're gonna need um, hold on let's look again I've already forgotten phone cable and HVAC well, let's get rid of this one all right that sounds good so phone we'll put here and then cable we're gonna put over here and then HVAC can only be built on floor number minus one Compressor needs to be placed in the first basement level of your building. Oh, it's it's large. Um, okay, okay, hold on. We're wasting a little bit of money. We've still got tons of room with these larger closets. So then what we'll do is we'll change this one over here to H... Wait. Oh, it has to be built on this floor. Okay, that's fine. And then HVAC vents are placed on the exterior of your building above the ground floor. Oh. Interesting. Okay, that's fine. Let's get... Let's get our cable TV closet. There we go. Now, um... Should I just run from here? I feel like I should. All right. So then the electricity will go out this way. And so will the phone. Yep. Uh, that's kind of... Well, I guess I could have... Mm, no, I don't... I don't know. These, these single rooms might not stay single rooms. Oh, we're out of money. Big time out of money. Um, how do you not have electricity? Hold up. Oh no. Oh no. My event coordinator has no electricity. Well, we need people to check in and out of their hotels. Their hotel rooms. That's what we need. Get some of this money. I don't want to take out another loan. Yeah, we're still making payments on our first loan. Our community bank loan. That's okay. We'll get paid. These people will check out in a minute. We'll just let the time go by. Ooh, we could, um... Mm, we could schedule an event, and then... Booking of limited performers. Nah. Not, not yet, not yet. That's not how I want to do this just yet. Let's wait till everybody pays us. Hmm. Oh, yep. Total expenses through the roof. Oh, my goodness. Oh, no. Um, we're going to need another loan, perhaps. Yikes. Perhaps jumping into that casino was... Mm, well, let's see. If we went here to the commercial bank loan. Yep, let's do that. Ooh, right. We just took out a commercial bank loan. Yikes. That's okay. We've got to get power to our event promoter here. Okay. And then, what? We've got cable TV connection. Right? And then we need HVAC. And hopefully, hopefully this, this casino will make us lots and lots of money. I'm hoping. All right, good. Yes, I know I took out a loan. Oh, we're only making $1 a day. We need to make some money. Let's go ahead and book ourselves a performer. Um, and I can't because performer is not available. Really? 
Is there not? Mm -hmm. Um, oh, it's waiting to be cleaned up. Okay. Oh, my goodness. There's a rowdy crew in there. They really... That place is a disaster area. Oh, my goodness. Well, we've got our casino going. Daily rent. Nice. Revenues for today, yesterday, zero customers. Well, you're going to start to get some customers now. Draw on some guests and visitors to your hotel. Wonderful. That's good. That's what I want. Um, this is kind of yucky here. Oh, we can do some stuff. Hotel management? No. Aesthetics. I kind of want to do that, but we need an interior decorator. Um, no, I don't really want to do that there. That's... Huh. I don't really want to do that there either. I'd like to start getting some of these double rooms. Booked for three more days. Booked uh -huh. through tomorrow. Wow, a lot of these are booked. Hmm. Thing is, as I don't want to put a bar or a casino right next to these hotel rooms. I have a feeling that they won't like that. And it's bad enough. Well, I don't know. I imagine the resort manager is pretty pretty good buffer between the hotel rooms and the casino. How's the casino doing? Revenue so far? Well, that's good. They're about to break even at least. Got some people gambling in there. Yeah, sure, that's good. Hey, we're making money. I can dig it. Let's see how we're doing here. Barely using the cables. All that's at 20% just with this casino connection. Hey, look at that. We made money. Wonderful. Let's start looking at some of these double rooms, I guess. Double occupancy hotel room. Booked. No, this room is not booked. Boom. Booked. Nope, current guest checks out today. Room is not booked. Boom. Booked through tomorrow, through tomorrow. All right, let's 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 hire an event. Um, Ralph and the Oak Park Boys, local crooner. I like that. Yes. Let's go ahead and beef up the ticket price a little bit. Yeah. I like that. Okay. Yep. On the Iron Coast, floor zero. Thank you. See, I wonder if it would be better. These are $10 a day maintenance, but so I'm wondering if cost to place electrical lines is zero. Minus 13. Oh my, so no, it's expensive. It's expensive to run those cable lines like that. Hmm. Might be cheaper just to put up a closet over here, but then I'm taking up more space. Otherwise, everything's got to wire out from this service elevator. That might be the way to do it. Emphasis on might be. I'm not sure. We should get ourselves another um, another bar, though. Right? I think that's... Could do another bar like this, right above the casino. No, we need to get more tenants. Let's build close to the service elevator. That's, that's going to be... That's going to be what we want. All right, let's check out these rooms. Book through tomorrow. See if we can start. Current guest checks out today. They haven't changed yet. Oh, I know. The destination's unreachable. We're going to get that fixed. There we go. And then we're going to pop in our wiring closets. Yep. Just like that. All right, let's get ourselves some double rooms so we can have 
something like this. Yesterday's cash flow. No breakfast places here? Yes, there are. I have service breakfast and lunch. They serve coffee and breakfast. You hush your mouth. I don't even know what that's all about. Uh, Mover's office is necessary to coordinate the relocation of tenants within your building. Storage for retail stores, transit, and lobbies. Hmm. Have you checked out? Current guest checks out today. This room is not booked. Junk. Bye bye. Okay. Um. Yeah, you know what? We might as well. Oh no, we're losing money. Rapidly. Um. Okay. All right. Let's go ahead and put in our elevator there, and then let's try a double occupancy room right here. See how this looks. Double deluxe hotel room. Don't have enough prestige. Deluxe front desk. We don't have more restaurants, more stores. Whoa, requires a lot. How about this one? We can do this. Double hotel room requires electric water and HVAC. Luggage services needed. Okay, so we need luggage services. <laughs> there we go, luggage services. Yes, where's that? There we are. Guests drop off their luggage here and then it gets delivered to their room. Um. Oh, my. Stuff is kind of, yeah, renovate. Look how yucky that place is. Nobody wants to eat there. You know what? You guys are going to have to get kicked out. Ah, oh, but that's our only lunch spot. No, okay, that's fine. That's fine. Let's go ahead and... I think we'll take our... We'll get rid of this. Um, let's go ahead and pause it so we don't lose any more money. Um, ooh, we could promote our event. When does our event take place? Oh, this place is run down as well. Scheduled for today at 2100. What is it? It's 1 in the morning? That sounds good. Uh, hire an event promoter to increase awareness, attendance, and ticket price for an upcoming event. It's best to activate this campaign a few hours before the event is due to start. Okay, we'll wait. Um, you know, I'm still just not hearing much of that music. I think the sound effects are good, but I like that relaxing music. All right. What we're going to need to do is clear this out, I imagine. That's why they're not letting me put the luggage movers in here. There we go. Oh, I can hear it. Services, hotel, luggage services. Why can't it go there? Oh, because of that light. Because of a light fixture on the wall. Uh, what about all that? Mm -hmm. I'm going to have that little gap there. That's fine. So we'll have our luggage services. And then let's go ahead and look up here. We're going to need electric and water and HVAC. Double room. That's going to bother me, that, like, gap there. I wonder if there is something we can... Ooh, small nightclub. Now we have that prestige going for us. Mm, we're not able to build out past that, are we? No, we are not. I don't know if I'm going to like these elevators here in the long run. 
That's fine. Let's go ahead and get ourselves a nightclub. Needs a trash bin on the same floor. Okay, well, we just won't worry about it. Let's build a few more of these double rooms. There we go. Are you booked for two more days? Through tomorrow, three more days? Okay. We're gonna need more of that money. Gotta spend money to make money, as the adage goes. So let's spend some money. Get these rooms wired with AC. Which kind of makes you wonder why the other rooms don't have AC. Like, I get that they're, you know, single rooms, they're lower quality, they don't demand as much, but I would think any hotel I go to is going to... Is gonna need AC. Oh, I forgot the. I forgot to hire the event promoter. Oh, look at him go. Uh huh. There you go. Sing it. Oh, and they're packed. Bringing Buzz to my little pizza shop and casino. Okay, so we spent a good bit that day. That's fine. I understand it. Got some of these double rooms booked. That's good, I like that. How about you? Are you done yet? No. Not a chance. Nope, and there they go. They're, they've headed on out. Hmm, got two loans active. I'm a little... I'm a little nervous about that. Double standard hotel rooms. Hotel bars. Small nightclubs. 50, 50 tourists have checked into your hotel. Hmm. Book through tomorrow. Two more days. What is our occupancy like? Mm, no, I'm not looking for that. I guess, yeah, here. Wow, that's a lot of positive reviews. Okay, out of 36 rooms... 33 are booked, and all 36 are clean. 100% recent positive reviews, 95% overall. That's that's good. That's that's really, really good. Housekeeping is needed. Whoa, housekeeping is needed. That bar crowd is rowdy. Hopefully our housekeepers can keep up with all that. Wow, HVAC getting used up fast. I think it said the next HVAC has to go out here, right? On the on the side of the building? Like up here? I mean, it can't be out, outside, outside the building. It's, yeah. No, we don't need that yet. What am I doing? That's going to cost 350 per day. We don't have that kind of money to spend. Instead, um, instead we're going to increase the next floor. There we go. So we'll get our service elevator and our individual elevator. And move up our wiring closets again. And I think we'll just repeat what we did. I, I kind of like this. And electricity... All right, okay, I'm aware. Oh, oh, yep, run out of money. Thing is, is I want to build another bar or a small nightclub, but I'm afraid we don't have the, um, we don't have the occupancy or the available occupancy to handle that. Booked for two more days. This needs to be, um, this needs to be emptied. I want to kick this person out for crying out loud, but I don't want a negative review, so. <laughs> We're gonna have to wait for people to give us some money. I'm not taking out another loan. I should have hired that uh, event promoter. That's okay. Okay. 
How's the casino doing? Revenues yesterday. We're happy we're making a profit. Oh, I think you guys can afford to pay me a little bit more on that rent. You made sixteen ninety five yesterday? Yeah. Rent is too high. No, no, it's not. I just cut into your profits. You're fine. You're the only casino in the building. You've got a, you know, captive audience. Now let's get some more of these double rooms going here. Yep, water needs to go this way. And then where's our HVAC? Yeah. Wonderful. Okay, and double hotel rooms. One, two, three, and four. I love it. Let's do it. That'll make us some more money. Can we kick this person out yet? No, they're booked for two more days. But we can hire another event. Dawn E, Virginia Yellow, Stephen C and his band, BB Prince. Mmm, requires a large nightclub. Stephen C and his band. Yeah. On the Iron Coast, please. Thank you. Go ahead and get ourselves another, um, another bar. Requires a trash bin on the same floor, so probably going to need to be over here. That way they can use the same trash bin. And we can build off of the wires we already have in place. I like that. Oh, there we go. Minus 300. Booked through tomorrow. Ah, but our double rooms are booked. <gasps> Utilization 56%. No, 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 no. Oh, I forgot to give you electrical wiring. That's so not good. Oh, anybody that stays in that room is going to be very upset with me. And all these rooms are booked. We can't function without an electrical line. Oh, this room is not booked. Um, I suppose I could remove it for now until... Yeah, let's just do that. We'll just remove it for now. There's no point in having that room there like that. Booked through tomorrow. Scheduled for tomorrow, so we're going to queue up our event promoter before the event happens. All right. Looks like the maids are going out. It's our event coordinator. Do we have any buildings that need renovation? No, we sure don't. I have this little tiny construction office over here. But it's meeting our needs for now. There we go. Now we've got the ability to put in some electrical wiring. So now we'll put in our double room here. Wasted a little bit of money, but not too much. And then what about you? Booked through tomorrow still. Okay, that's fine. I think what we need to do... is get ourselves another bar over here. That's what I think, personally. Well, let's see, what can we add? Decorative objects? Yes, how about a lovely palm tree? Perfect. Are you guys good there? Excellent. Let's get ourselves another bar. Please and thank you. And then we'll just go ahead and wallpaper that wall right there. That seems kind of goofy. Oh, it is what it is. Let's get them wired up here with what they're going to need, which is going to be electricity and water. Yeah. I'm pretty sure it's water as well. We can check here, I believe. Yes. They do require water. Oh, no. It happened to me again. We went through our money. Teaming with tourists is going to be difficult. Two pairs shouldn't be that difficult. Oh, I know you need water. 
I know. Oh, the satisfaction is plummeting. Just... Just hang in there. Hang in there. We can't take out any loans. What have I done? Spending money oh so fast. Oh so fast. How are we doing? 60% utilization on our electricity. 40% on water. H HVAC is maxed out. Phone and cable are... Or, or cable and... Yeah, phone are only at 20%. Guests should be checking out soon and they'll pay us. Yeah, I know. Very upset. Very sad. This, this bar is not going to get any kind of attention while well, it doesn't have a water hookup. I mean, can you imagine a bar without water? That's just sad. That's sad indeed. Hey, there we are. Good deal. Let's get that water going. Thank you. Oh, they're so upset with me. So upset. And requires a trash bin, but there is a trash bin. They've just got to carry it all, all the a long way. Well, that's that's you know that is what it is. Let's get some wallpaper up there. I don't like the way that looks. Have you checked out yet? Oh, still not checked out. Would love to be able to get rid of you. I'm just not sure what I want to do over here. Oh, the nightclub. That's what we need to do. Requires a trash bin on the same floor. Ooh, right above the casino. Mm. We could put a trash bin over there, but then we've got these hotel rooms right next to the trash bin. That doesn't seem like a good idea. Nobody wants to be next to the trash. Huh. Let's do our nightclub, which is going to need electric, water, cable, and trash. Oh, it can be down underground. That seems kind of... No, it's not an underground nightclub. No, we're going to... It's Project High Rise, not Project Basement. <laughs> Let's go ahead and put it up here. On the third floor, above the casino. Adjacent to but above the casino. I like that. And then what we're going to do is we're going to we're going to expand this out. I don't know if we're going to use it all just yet, but we're going to expand it out. Right? And then we're going to get the electricity and the water. And what else did it say they needed? That's it. And trash. I could have sworn it said they needed more. And a cable TV connection. Well, you didn't. You did not inform me of that, which. That's gonna be an awful long cable TV wire just to get over here. I could put a closet up over this way. Mm, I should have had a second. Because that's going to cost a lot of money, actually, running that across there. From here... Oh my goodness, I don't have the money for that. That being said, I could put a couple of closets here and then run it across that way, I suppose. Uh, that's not really what I had in mind, though, unfortunately. Decisions, decisions... Hmm. You know what? I can already predict we're going to need that mover's office. We're going to need to be able to relocate people. That's what we're going to need to do. I should have had the service elevator in the middle. I should have put everything in the middle. Well, oh, it is what it is. Oh, they don't have cable TV. They're so disappointed in me. Mary Tyler Less, comedian. Yes. Absolutely. Club Budapest on the... Oh, no, no, no. What have I done? Uh, there's no cable TV here. Okay. Well, we've got to fix that problem before the end of the day. 
Let's get that cable TV wired just as far as we can, huh? Oh, we did it. Woo, not so bad. And I forgot to hire the event promoter again. That's okay. We'll get them squared away. Let's hire another person. Um, Terry White? Sure. Um, on the... On C Blacks. Floor zero. Wonderful. The city's economy is entering a depression. Small businesses are hunkering down and trying to minimize their rents. However, construction costs are also getting cheaper. Ooh. So now this just looks yucky. I don't know what all this is about. You need to be uh, relocated is what you need to be. Need to figure out something here. Maybe we'll just do that for now. I don't know. I don't necessarily want it to be all the single rooms on this floor, but perhaps that the way it's the way it goes. Still don't have enough tourists in the hotel to meet this contract, but we have we are holding at least one event in a small nightclub, and we need more double standard rooms, which means we're going to need um, we're going to need HVAC. Because they require HVAC, and our AC is maxed out. There we go. Look at that. Okay, let's... What are you upset about? Could not dispose of our trash yesterday. Um, yeah. Sorry about that. There you go. Hopefully that will fix that problem. Good thing the event is not till tomorrow. And we'll get that trash taken care of and squared away. Thank you. And then we're going to need... Um, let's put our compressor... Mm, probably here, I think, is a good... Wonderful. There we go. Okay, so now we can go up to the next floor, right? And we can just kind of repeat this process. So I don't want to expand too much at once, but I want to be able to hold more people now that we've got three different event venues. And our casino is doing really well, actually. Let's go ahead and we'll get our service elevator and then our patron elevator. Oof, out of money. Well, so we won't be able to build there right away. That's fine. You need to get out of there. <laughs> this person, they're just like, no, I really like this room. It's kind of off by itself with all these construction windows. <laughs> That's funny. At least we put the service elevators in so our construction crew could get to work. And, um... Let's go ahead and stick with this little wallpapered theme over here. Um, down here as well, I don't really, I don't really like those construction looking walls. Let's, let's take care of all this, shall we? Mm, it says we gained money, but now we're broke. See, I don't want to necessarily do all of these the same, but I'm just trying to very quickly get rid of this this ugly look on these first floors. I'm not sure how I want to handle this bridge because I'm pretty sure... What are you upset about? Could not dispose of our trash yesterday. Er, oh. Really? No. They're doing better now. Yeah. Because they've... They've got... They can take out the trash now. They'll be happy here in a minute. They're getting better. I just want this person to check out through tomorrow and then we'll open up all these double rooms on the next floor and I gotta figure out some kind of a buffer between these single rooms and the nightclub what would go here maybe a restaurant Services. 
restaurants. Medium restaurant? No, we can't do that. We could do a small restaurant. Eh. Large restaurant. Oof, no, we're not doing all that. Retail store? Ooh, I could put a small store. Oh, I can't put a small store. Oh, there's not enough room. Unless I get rid of this room and that room. So we get rid of this room and we can throw in a small retail store. Ah, oh, but do I want to go that road yet? Because retail services need um, storage, right? Yeah, they need storage bays for retail store. Supply room for your building's custodians. The three broom closets. Broom closets reduce the accumulation of grime and disrepair on the floor they're located on. That's fine. I still didn't hire my event promoter. How bad is that? But that's okay. We're going to make a lot of money here. There's Mary Tyler Less. Nope. Yeah, they're at the nightclub. Should have hired that event promoter since we had double, double events going on. Mm, I don't think we made that much money. No, really, the bottom line is we need to get uh, we need to get more double rooms built up here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. That would work. That's kind of what we need. But unfortunately, that's going to have to wait until next episode. Oh, and I. I'm sorry about this eyesore. I did, this is this room is really irking me. I'm about to kick this person out and take the negative review, <gasps> which we got negative reviews. It's okay. They need better sound insulation. Oh, see, that's what I'm worried about. Mm hmm. Too close to that nightclub. And look, this place isn't even being cleaned up yet. We're going to need more event staff, but uh, it's too easy to just one more one more thing on this game. That is going to be where we wrap things up as we start to earn money, as people check out. Thank you so much for joining me. This has been Project High Rise Episode 2. I hope you had a good time watching, because as always, I had a good time playing and sharing with you, my lovely viewers. Come back next time as we ooh, hopefully get all this stuff clean and knock out these contracts. But until then, take care.